It's about to go down. Period number three. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro, ready to bring you the action. The Oilers win the draw and get their penalty killing unit off to a good start. The Rangers have it against the wall. Passes it to Mejia. The Rangers are on the attack. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. In a close game, James, the coach is showing a lot of confidence in his rookie. The youngster will go back on the ice here with the instruction of carry the play, push the pace. They don't want to sit back. Interesting play as they try to preserve this lead here. New York's turned good defense into good offense as they lead it early in this third period. The Oilers win the faceoff. And now he moves it quickly to Cassian. And it's a quick pass to Hamilton. Nice pass. Let's it go, and he comes up with it. We're still in the early stages of this period. 2-0 is where we sit. The Oilers win it. Denies him! Chesterkin's right on top of that chance. Great A spot, great A save. Steps inside the line. Big play inside the defensive zone. Couldn't connect on that pass. His reflexes on display tonight. I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. The setters will glide into the dot. May has won the draw here in the offensive zone. Oh, what a reactionary save on the one-timer. Edmonton's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Torres moves the puck. And they'll dump it in. The Rangers gain control of the puck against the wall. Panarin swooping in on the attack. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. The Oilers get a hold of the puck off the draw. Well, a challenge being laid here. Shane's turning this challenge down. That's not part of his game. They're going to have to look at him immediately. He's just slowly working his way to the bench, James. They score! What a shot! That's a great sound when it pings off the post, and then you don't hear anything except you see the goal light. What a shot. Here, they have owned this game. Unless they fall asleep, James, this thing is over. They've dominated. Puck scooped up by Truba. And now it's grabbed by Mata. Handles the pass from the right wing. Nice defensive robbery on that. McDavid's got it in the offensive zone. Cuts into the paint. Hammers a shot. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. Puck grabbed by Strom. Nice poke check. Edmonton's got the puck along the boards. Nice feed from the left side up the middle. Now a quick pass to Pollock. Gives them nothing in front. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Scores! Connor McDavid! Edmonton's narrowed the gap here in the third, but still a long way to go, Ray. James, this is still way down the road to even this game up. But if you get one, maybe you get another. Maybe they get nervous. Lots of time left in this period. The Oilers are still trailing by two. Takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Just wide. Slides it over to Panarin. Receives the pass. Jostled off the puck. Quick pass to Shane. Gains the zone from the right side. Lowers the boom with that hit. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Stopped by the goaltender. He scores! Putting the special in special teams tonight. Uh, the extra work they've done, the way that they've moved some people around, has helped them cash in more than once on the power play. The Rangers are in cruise control here, but they're showing no signs of letting up. Now, the lesson began about two hours ago. 
and it's not class out yet. Moves it quickly over to Strom. Moves it up through the middle for the right. Panarin's been all over the place. It's like there's two of them on the ice. He's already got three points. Oh, what a block! He'll get a pat on the back from the coach when he gets off, if he can get off. And the parade to the penalty box will continue as play is called for yet another penalty. Two minutes for tripping. Time of the penalty. Caught him just as he was picking up speed, and he's going to pay for it with the trip. Oh, you're spinning with him. You're trying to get your stick into the puck lane, and you end up tripping him up. New York's got possession here in their own end. The Rangers take it along the wing. Here's a chance. Can't find his man. That pass doesn't go. Hangs onto the puck. The Rangers gain possession in their own end. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Here comes the call. Tripping the call on the play. I don't necessarily think he's trying to trip him here, James, but he gets a stick into his feet. Down he goes. Angles it over to Turris. Edmonton's got it across the line. New York's gained possession along the boards. Here's a short pass to Panarin. And he regains control of the puck. Here's a blast, and he makes the easy save. Moves the puck across to Turris. Moves it to Shane. Edmonton's got the puck against the boards. They're able to wind the clock down a little bit here. They don't score on that power play. I don't know that it's particularly important. They don't want to give up anything because they've got such a large lead. They want to run this in on cruise control. The Rangers offense has been the story tonight as they continue to lead big time in the third. Quick feed to Mejia. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. And he slides it quickly to Cahoon. Takes it to the net. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. A little rock him, sock him on the play. Picked up along the wall by Pulak. Passes over to Neal. Here's a shot. Way too much congestion blocks that. And he slides it quickly to Jones and makes the save. Picking up some steam at center ice. Gets it over to Grabner. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Takes a shot. Nice save by the keeper to trap that puck to his chest. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. New York's got a little more jump in their step tonight. They lead it 4-1. Fantastic save! Quick pass to Shane. Slides the puck over. Taken by Grabner. That's wide of the net. Not going to get many better chances from that. Dead center, right in the slot. Moves it quickly over to Mejia. That pass goes a little sideways. Tape to tape feed on the blue line. Here's a shot, and the stick, his best friend on that save right there. Here's a short pass, scores on the one-timer. Goalie's probably got to stop this, but I don't think he's set, James. That turnover didn't give him much time to get set in the net. The Rangers are on absolute cruise control here in the third. Well, they've built such a large margin, you can use your whole bench and coast it in. Moves it to Hamilton. Move to the middle. Here he is in front. Turn that one aside. Unable to reach that one. And the always popular icing call made. And you know what that means, Ray? Yeah, offensive zone faceoff, man. He missed the play going down the ice. And that's a gimme icing. Now they can't change. You've got tired guys on the ice. Back at the point, they set it up. Dreisaitl's got the puck. On the heels of their blades, trying to get it out. Off his own man, and it stays in. With the blast. Denies him. He got off. New York's got the puck in the defensive end. Sends the pass over. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Slides the puck across to McDavid. Sends a pass over. 
From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Who's the puck? Another big hit! Man, this guy has one color on his mind, and it's the other team's jersey. Skate, hit, skate, hit. It's been that all night. Takes a shot. Oh, he scores! There's their second of the night. Well, I guess they can look at this and say, hey, we did a couple of good things way too late, but it's something for them to try and build on. Puck is shot and play resumes. Quick feed to Dreisaitl. And he stands tall and goal. Assisted by number 40. The Rangers have pummeled their opponents tonight. They have been the busier team offensively and have converted numerous times here in this third period. Just seconds of scores! Again, these guys' arms are going to get tired. Two goals in 10 seconds. Buckle up, everybody. We're not done yet. The centermen glide into position. champions they've also immortalized themselves with their names on the cup what an amazing accomplishment we see it year after year the celebrations are so similar but each one of them a little different and certainly more personal for each of these guys What a series, and both sides paying respect here, Ray. Well, they'll shake hands, but I know the winning side, this is like a speed bump to getting their hands on the Stanley Cup, which they can't possibly imagine what it'll be like. It's funny, it's a beautiful trophy, your playoff MVP, and yet nobody seems to really want to hold on to it, Ray. No, because everybody in the building, including the players, is waiting for the next one to be out there and to be presented. And that, of course, is the Stanley Cup. He's coming to collect the Stanley Cup. I can't even imagine how hard his heart is beating right now. It, it must be an amazing feeling. Every time I see them hoist the cup year after year, I feel a little pang of jealousy that I never got to do it. Look at this. What a great celebration. Oh, they get to take the tour with the championship. I can't even imagine what that feeling must be like. What an amazing accomplishment to win. And it must be such relief to get your hands on the trophy to realize this is it. This is what I played for. The team picture, this was something that 99 started, did he not? Yeah, I believe it was his last year in Edmonton where they won, called everybody together. What an unreal photo to have. 